EPA Administrator Lee Zeldin has doubled down on his decision to approve new PFOS forever chemical pesticides by calling public backlash fake news. In a self-issued letter attempting to debunk the news, Zeldin tried to correct the record, but in turn revealed the EPA's true intentions. The EPA purposefully excludes single fluorinated atoms from their definition of PFOS so that they can approve new pesticides that are considered forever chemicals by state agencies and the broader scientific community that isn't paid off by the chemical industry. The short-chain PFOS isocycloceram and cyclobutrifluram can persist in the environment and break down into trifluoroacetic acid or TF which is one of the most widespread contaminants in water. There is concern for these compounds damaging reproductive, immune, and liver health. What was really telling in Zeldin's letter is that he attacked organic farming and positioned it as just as, if not more toxic, than the new chemicals he approved. The fundamental misunderstanding or dismissal of organic farming principles and goals highlights once again how the EPA has been co-opted by the chemical industry. If you're interested in finding local and organic farms, you can use my free farm app at the link in my bio, and if you want to grow your own food, you can plant my heirloom seeds.